beautiful goddesses, beautiful goddesses, women, humans, beings, beautiful. Welcome. I'm here with Nicole. And um, we're here today to invite you and to tell you something really, really exciting and something that we are so inspired to bring out to you, also to ourselves. Um, so I just want to say hello and um, give a few words as well to Nicole to say hello. Awesome. Well, hello, everyone, and happy Saturday. And I hope you're enjoying this day, whether you're inside or outside, watching now or watching the replay later. We just wanted to come on and, hey, it's 333. I wonder what the new model is. Oh, wow. Right now. Yes. <laughs> yes. Well, we're, we're definitely hopping into some very... Um, potent energetic uh, days uh, ahead of us and it has it it fits in the timing beautifully um, so Anya and I are a part of the Temple Body Arts Global Mentorship Group uh, a container and we have also been weaving some magic in and out and we've been in co deep conversation just about where we are um, and um, specifically, we felt we've, we've been both feeling in a space of wanting to just launch, like relaunch ourselves into the world, onto the online space, and also catapult our offerings um, that uh, we have been creating. You know, this space has been throughout since, you know, the beginning of the year and especially through March and onwards, you know, we've been in this cocoon of really getting, doing some deep work on ourselves and also deep a reflection on um, uh, what do we want to put out into the world and how are we serving uh, with great impact. And, you know, through our mentorship, we've been getting a lot more clear uh, in those areas. And as we're jumping into the month of August, um, my background is through dance, through athlete, athletics and wellness, and, and now the divine feminine. And we had a conversation about what it is to, you know, when you're preparing for something, you know, you train, you have a plan, there is a, you know, a set of, you, 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 you create this structure before you launch or create, uh, let, bring something out into the world. And I was speaking about like, I need to be in that training. And Anya was like, yes, me too. <laughs> and we're like, let's do this together. So as we were coming into the month of August, you know, tomorrow will be the start of the Lionsgate portal. And it will go until mid-August. So around August 13th is when the portal will start to close. And, and this is a beautiful, very energetic time for transformation and creation. Um, so we, we thought, we, we were like, okay, let's do this. Let's, let's, let's really like be, hold ourselves accountable. And for 31 days, give ourselves, you know, exercise, um, not exercises, but tasks and um, radical steps and action steps to hold ourselves accountable so by the end of it, we have, our, we have fully launched an offering or just really be out there and revealing the things that we've been learning about, revealing a thought, ideas, processes, what have you. So by September, you know, you know exactly who we, you, you know this elevated version, this elevated place that we are in. Um, you know about the offers that we are putting out into the world. 
I have something, Anya has her, uh, has her offerings. And this really came about as we are, as we are divine goddesses in this divine feminine world and balancing out the energies of the masculine and feminine. And, you know, really allowing, embracing the masculine in forms of structure and in terms of focus. So this is really a mastermind. 31 days starting August 1st, a mastermind of the Lioness Gate portal, 31 day radical transformation, radical launching, radical revealing, radical action. So that's, that's, that's what we're, that's what we are, what we've agreed to do starting August 1st, starting on the long weekend, <laughs> you know. Amazing. Um, mm -hmm. Yeah, that's so beautiful. Thank you, Nicole. Like everything you said, that's, yeah, as we work through developing our understanding of what we are here to do and to bring, we begin to flow and we also begin to create structure or maybe we have the structure and then we flow around it. For me personally, I go with the flow. I have no structure, I have some structure. So I'd love to be a little bit more, um, um, yeah, the more committed to creating a structure around my flow. And so this idea was born through both of us. And um, yeah, 31 days of, of just transcending through what stands in our way, transcending through our fears to launch ourselves forward, whether it's our gifts deep within that we know are here, uh, maybe discovering something about yourself. It doesn't have to be a packaged deal. It could be yourself. It could be your voice. It could be one action that you would love to do for yourself. Um, one task, one intention that you can set and commit to 31 days through this lioness gate portal to be fully supported by two goddesses, by two divine feminine embodied leaders to support you every other day. We will be giving you prompts and tasks and things to do, things to discover. They could be little tiny ideas. Um, they could also be these huge, um, you decide how deep you go with each task. And um, yeah, it's, it, to truly prepare ourselves to what is to come. We are not just gonna show up, um, like I was telling Nicole, we're not just gonna show up to a spaceship, climb in and go into space. We are gonna take time to prepare and to build it and to learn it and to know how to fly the spaceship. So these 31 days, I feel, will truly be that propelling energy of the master mind, the, the collective mastermind group, completely um, offered to you by the divine at the energy of your commitment. This truly isn't going to cost you anything except for your own dedication your own promise to yourself to remember your gifts, remember your purpose, to bring your purpose forward. This is for all women inclusively. Come and join us. Um, be within our energy, be within each other, meet new women, meet new sisters have this incredible support, a platform where you can practice launching. You can bring forth your own ideas of launching or your own tips um, of what you learned in the past, of what mistakes we have made and how we can grow and learn from them. So it's a really that we're calling to the mastermind soul sisters, our soul mates, um, those women, who are here to, to meet each other and to grow together. And um, yeah, this will be an incredible, incredible offering to, 
to launch. Mm -hmm. So what's the basic framework? Uh, just as Anya said, we will be, uh, there will be daily uh, action, action steps, action goals to, um, to keep the momentum, to keep us on track. Also, we'll be gathering uh, weekly live. Uh, sometimes I will lead, sometimes Anya will lead. Um, and, um, and, you know, we, this is, this is um, a supportive container where we can, uh, we will be facilitating, but we are also doing the work. This is a, this is a container where we are holding ourselves accountable um, uh, to, to, um, to keep, uh, keep on track, right? Um, <clears throat> And so this is not, this is not about, um, uh, this is not for, if you are not willing to be committed, if you're not willing to devote um, daily time, right, to, to yourself, to, to yourself or to whatever creative process that you are in, um, if you are here to just watch, then we invite you to come on to our respective um, public or, or private uh, group pages where you, we can share, uh, you know, uh, messages uh, that are in alignment with our platforms. This Lion's Gate, Lioness Gate um, mastermind is just that. It is a mastermind, which means everybody that comes in has their own accountability. Um, as much as we are there to support, we are also doing our work as well, right? So just know that as you step into this, if you choose to step into this, um, your, your, your devotion is to show up. Your devotion is to do the work. Your devotion is to be accountable to yourself. You know, because as much as this container is, we all, we all have to hold ourselves accountable to um, what we are creating and the work that we are putting into it. And as we support each other and lift each other up, you know, um, it, it's, uh, it's important. The amount of energy you put in is the amount of energy that you're going to receive, right? So it's like if you're training to, I don't know, um, lose five pounds <laughs> or 10 pounds or whatever, right? Um, how are you setting yourself up for success? And how are you going to make that radical transformation? How are you going to hold yourself accountable? How are you setting up your space? What, what are you, when you're grocery shopping, what are you, what are you allowing into your cart? Um, you know, how are you meal planning? Um, you know, these are, these are, these are the things like, you know, mindset, environment, action, you know, daily practice, um, you know, uh, uh, visioning, you know, being in that focused mindset, you know, um, this takes a commitment. So if you're not ready for that, we totally understand, you know, this is an embodiment. This is like, are you ready to be, like to fully be who you know you are to be? If you're already there, great. If there's something more that wants to come out of you and embrace that fullness within you and in, into your work, as you would launch yourself out there, this is a launch. We're not just, you know, we're not just going to um, the rooftop. We're going to the stratosphere. We're going to the fifth, we're going with the frequency of the fifth dimension. This is where we're going. It's not like we're gonna die and go, hey, no, we're gonna stay in this physical realm, but our energy, you, we are lifting. It is literally, we are going, you see your physical self and, and, and into this other energetic space and you are melting into that energetic frequency. That's where we're going. So if you are ready for that, 
then we invite you to jump in with us and we will do our absolute best as we are holding ourselves and as we are supporting ourselves, we are there to support and continue the momentum with you. Wow. I feel all fiery and fired up. Thank you, Nicole. <laughs> you are fire, wild woman, lioness. Thank you. Wow. So yeah, beautiful goddesses, sisters, queens, women of all ages. We welcome you, we invite you, and yeah, we invite you to partake of this beautiful medicine that, that is coming through me and Nicole for you to experience, to take this opportunity. This will be magical, this will be divine, this will be transformational, and this is the work we're doing ourselves on a daily inner work we're committed and we're inviting all of you to come with us and to witness and to do your own work and to commit and to collaborate and create together this powerful portal for 31 days just visualize this maybe we can just visualize this together close your eyes take a breath feel this portal of fire this wild woman fire the lioness energy the strength and bravery the courage of the heart this is what is inside the solar that fire the sun that burns the sun that rises each morning to shine and to illuminate the whole earth with healing with that sacred solar ignition the gut instinctual feeling in inside of us that sense that moves us forward that propels us the dance between the masculine and the feminine the lion and the lioness the lion supporting the lioness fully the lioness dancing with the lion that energy within the energy of freedom of liberty, of creation, creating anything you desire, feeling into your intentions, feeling into your visions, into your truth, into your desires, into your power, into your sacred creativity and into manifestation of your dreams through this portal as you are invited to enter, to step through the threshold of, of anything that is in on your path whether it's fear whether it's feeling small or whether it's not knowing just allow yourself to be present feel the fire of this energy of transformation that it's your choice to take breathing in breathing in breathing in choosing your breath choosing your prana your divine life force that moves you that shifts you out of the comfort out of the complacency and into the divine action following the divine inspiration and trusting trusting every step of the way allowing yourself to be yeah beautiful <laughs> Beautiful beings. Thank you, Nicole. How are you feeling? I feel like I'm feeling complete. Yeah. That uh that meditate I was just thinking we need to channel in the line and we were just like on point with that. Mm. Yes, that that that's where we're going. That's where we're going. So in the next few days we will be um sharing more information. Um, about how you can join us. I shared the group in the yes, comments. Okay, beautiful. So that is the, the group that, uh, the private group where you can come on in and we will be sharing some pre-prep um, material um, or live videos um, within the next few days. And then August 1st, we start 
we start the joke. We're already started, but that is the official day. <laughs> that is the official day, August 1st. Mm -hmm. um, so again, if you are ready to commit, this isn't just, uh, you know, you feel the excitement, you're like, woo, this is great. And, you know, this is ready to commit, you know, because in this, as, as leaders, entrepreneurs, however we are in life, you know, at the end of the day, whether you pay money for something, whether you, when you say yes to something, at the end of the day, we hold ourselves accountable, you know, whether we do something or we don't do it. And this is a journey. This is a process. We're all human. Mm -hmm. You know, remembering that we are all human. We're going to make mistakes. We're going to sometimes get off alignment. But as we commit to our daily practices and as we move through life, and life will always test our commitment. Um, you know, it's, it, really, it really just puts us in a space of how committed are we? When we say yes to something, what does that truly mean? And how does that truly speak to mm -hmm. anywhere else in our lives? You know, what are we truly committed to in, our, in, in all aspects of our lives, not just our business, even though we are going to be talking a lot about our projects and things that we're doing, but also this is going to ripple out into our lives. The commitment to our relationships, the commitment to ourselves, the commitment to um, personal, professional, um, our environment, everything, what we stand for, how we show up, what, uh, you know, how we present ourselves. You know, I'm, I'm, I'm day two in my moon cycle, so I'm very much stripped down. Mm. You know? But uh, how do we give the space to honor ourselves? And also how do we get radical and do stretch, stretch ourselves so we can grow. Um, so thank you. Thank you, Nicole. Mm -hmm. And I am Anya Devi mm -hmm. and Nicole Pemberton. We're mm -hmm. just an introduction at the end. <laughs> so yeah, we can connect more elsewhere in the world, but we would love to see you in our group for sure in the next few days and we welcome you and this is a safe space for you to come and explore your divine soul and your divine gifts and be fully accepted, nourished, guided, nurtured, courted and fully witnessed in your transformation. Yeah, thank you so much for tuning in. Thank you, Nicole so proud and i'm so honored to do this work with you mm, same here mm. thank you anya and thank mm. you everybody enjoy the rest of your day the weekend and we'll see you soon bye <laughs>